Good morning, everybody. First things first, happy Thanksgiving day. I hope you guys are having an awesome Thanksgiving um, with your family, your friends, whomever that may be. I hope you guys get to chill, enjoy, eat way too much, and have a great Thanksgiving. Anyway, welcome to my daily vlog. It is episode 359, getting closer every day. Anywho, today is a packed day. So I just got my workout done, excited about that, and then I'm headed out. So I'm gonna go get a couple cups of coffee. I'm gonna hop on my motorcycle. Yes, I get a motorcycle ride today. I'm headed to Cape Coral. So um, one of the people that follows us uh, on our page reached out under one of my RC videos and he's like, look man, we have races every Wednesday morning at 10 a.m. Well, guess what? Today is Wednesday and I'm off work. So I was like, well, I'm gonna come check it out. And he told me I could, that I could drive his car when I get down there, um, his RC car. I don't know if I'm gonna do that or not, just because I would feel really bad if I broke his RC car. And I don't have much practice yet. I'm still like really, 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 really new. So I don't know if I wanna do that or not, but I do wanna go check it out. There's a, I think a dirt oval down there. Um, I don't know all the details, I'm gonna go check it out. So I'm gonna go down there, 10 o'clock. Then I'm gonna come back up here. I've already talked to the hobby shop. They're not gonna have the track open on Friday, but the track is open today. So I'm gonna grab my little buggy I just built, hop in the truck, and then I'm gonna head to the RC shop and I'm gonna run it around the track for a little while. So today, today is a full, fun, RC day, and I cannot wait. So, that being said, I need coffee, I need to get the hell out of here. So we'll see you guys on the road. All right, it's that time. It's time to head to Cape Coral, check out that racetrack. I, funny thing is I lived in Cape Coral for seven years and had no idea that this track was around. I don't know how long it's been around, but I don't ever remember hearing anything about it. I swear, man, RC racing is like the best kept secret in the world. Um, unless you like really dive into it, you just don't hear much about it. Um, damn it, I'm gonna change that. Anyway, I get a bike ride this morning as well. It's gonna be a great day. Here we go. Yeah! All right, we found it. And they're racing. It's a little oval track. Let's check it out. Check that out. Pretty cool track. So this is called RC Hawks Race Track. Everybody's sitting up there racing. Kind of under a shield. Looks like there's some cars back there. Davidson cars out front. Oh. No carnage. That car's fast. Chaos and zoos. Alright guys, so that's a wrap here at the circle track in Cape Coral. 
Um, it was a lot of fun. They're still going at it. But I want to go home and get my buggy and go race at the track. So um, I want to sh shout out to Chuck. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for uh, kind of showing me the ropes, explaining everything. Man, guys, this is there's so many different things you can do and so many different cars and, and styles you can race uh, from dirt to asphalt to nitro to electric to carpet. I mean, the possibilities are endless. And I know they have like drag racing and mudding and tractor pull. They have all that stuff. Just like, you know, the big the big boy sports, they have them all in, uh, in RC. So you should definitely check it out if you're a gearhead like me. Um, just a lot of fun. Anyway, I'm out of here. We'll see you guys. All right, back at home and ready. Ready to take that bad boy out and get some track time. There's Honey. So today is Honey's Gotcha Day. Two years ago today, we went to the Humane Society and we found each other. And so today is her gotcha day. We didn't know what, what a good name for it was. It's not really her birthday. So this is her gotcha day. Uh, we got her two years ago today. Huh, Hunters? How's my baby? How's my baby, huh? Yes. Anyway, let's go get some track time in. First time on the track. Wish me luck. Hi, right, guys. So I'm here at the hobby shop. There's the car getting ready to run its first run. Here's the driver's stand. A pretty nice driver's stand. Check this thing out. And here's the track. This should be interesting. Wish me luck. minutes in and I suck anyway first 15 minutes I'm having a freaking blast I'll get better it's just gonna take practice practice makes perfect right just like riding a motorcycle or anything when you get started you just keep going and going and going till you get it right uh, and then you tweak and tune and tweak and tune till you become better and better so that's what I'm gonna do looks like it might rain does that look like rain to you it's like rain to me if it rains, that'll probably cut my time short, but until then, I'm going to keep running. <sighs> I'm giving the car a break. I'm giving myself a break. But anyway, I thought I would uh, give you the, the tour. So there is your driver's stand. Out here, I'm assuming this is where they have the timing stuff. Just guessing. Don't know for sure. Let's walk the track. So, come down the straight. Got a nice little jump here into a curve ramp flat ramp i don't know what it's called i'm sure there's terminology corner corner and this one here is kind of tricky you come up and then you got to make a make a quick right so i've been trying to figure out the fastest way around that then around the s here here and then the jump and down the main straight. If you jump straight, you're gonna run into that. So you gotta kinda hit it at an angle. You can tell where most land. Looks like they land like right in here, as you can see in the carpet. And then back to the main straight. That is the track. It's a cool little track. 
I'm having fun and I'm the only one out here. So I imagine when there's a group of people out here, it's a blast. Oh, so they told me that the first, the next like race day is a week from this Sunday. Hmm. Can I get enough practice in that I feel comfortable coming out here and racing? The last thing I want to do is be that jerk off on the track that is so bad that he's just crashing into everybody's cars and breaking shit and I don't want to be that guy. So we'll see how much practice I can get in between now and then. Uh, worst case scenario, I will at least come and watch. But man, I sure would love to come out and, and race. Notice that the track is black and orange. My bike is black and orange. The Badger's black and orange. I see a theme. Even the box Mama Badger got me 20 years ago for my RC stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's black and orange too. <laughs> How cool is that? Anyway, back to practice. We'll see you in a bit. All right. Well, it was a successful day. I got the buggy out. I got on the track. What an awesome day. I got to hit two different RC tracks today. So a dirt oval, and then you saw the carpet track. Pretty cool. And then I saw a video earlier where they also have drag racing. They had like $20,000 to win an RC drag race. I think it was in Oklahoma or something like that. Just freaking crazy. All this RC stuff like is like beyond anything that I realized till I started looking at it. And then it's like, it's all the stuff they do in the big cars, just scaled down and uh, still uber competitive. But anyway, awesome day today. It is Thanksgiving today when you're watching this. So happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy some time with your family. That's what I'm going to do. And we'll see you guys tomorrow.